Yo guys, it's up Soulfly. Welcome back to the newest video. Today I'm gonna to be talking about what it takes for me to find beats in the background of my video. I'm gonna be playing GTA and it's kind of modded just a little bit. I'm going off my original save right now and then I'll go to the modded save that I have whenever I die inevitably at some point. So uh, yeah, let's get into this. First we gotta get this take off. That was a lot easier and very abrupt. Guess we're just gonna cause some havoc and see what happens. Already got a three star warning. Dope. Some of you guys may be starting YouTubers, some of you guys may have been doing this for years, but one of the things that I find very difficult is to find beats in the background of my music. One of the problems that you can run into is whenever you're looking up beats, if you look on YouTube for people that post free beats, sometimes there's channels that do it, but you have to go through this long process of just downloading everything, going through links. Sometimes there isn't even links in the description for you to use, and then people are asking questions down in the comments, nobody answers. It's just a long hassle. You also run into the issue of copyright strikes, which is the bane of YouTube. It's scarier every time you get one. I've only had one on this channel, but in channels before, I think the first channel I had had three copyright strikes. If you don't already know this, and if you get three strikes on your channel, your channel gets terminated. You could have millions of subscribers potentially, or just a couple, get enough strikes and your channel's gone. I feel like every time I'm flying the plane, I gotta turn my head whenever I turn. Let me know if any of you guys do that. Jeez, I wanna do it again. I'm just turning like this and I wanna turn my head. I would be terrible at VR games. Some bigger YouTubers have run into copyright strike problems before and it's usually a pretty good topic for a video to make because if somebody big gets one, it's a big deal. They try to find out the company that did it, see if it's an actual copyright strike instead of someone just messing with their stuff. It sucks because there's companies out there that will just come after someone. You can potentially have a large amount of videos struck down. You can get more than three strikes almost instantly. Imagine uploading like 20 videos and then someone's like, no. Part of that's mine. Your entire channel gets taken down. If that's your livelihood and that's how you make money, your income is gone. One of the issues that I saw too trying to find beats for background is if somebody is making beats and they say that it's free for a while and then at some point they decide to monetize it, you're gonna run into the issue of videos that you had forever ago potentially getting copyright strikes because of that new rule that they have set on their audio. Oh, there's another plane. So many planes. Where'd my jet go? Oh, no, that's another plane. Okay. Wait. Come on, come on, can I? No, no, no. I'm just gonna shoot this plane. I wish I had fire bullets on this plane, would be dumb for. I'm probably gonna die. Yeah, I'm dead. If that happens, then you're gonna go all the way back to the problem that I said before of all of your videos can potentially be taken down and your entire channel gone. Luckily for me, I came across this guy on Twitter. He tweeted at me. Asking for a DM. His name is Zay. Hopefully I'm pronouncing it right. Z-A-E. You guys can check his links out below in my description. They're going to be from, from every point that I'm working with him. They're going to be in the description. You can follow his links. Go check out his SoundCloud and his Twitter. Make sure to hit him up if you guys need some beats. I'm sure he'd be able to work with you guys. That's a huge weight off my shoulders as a YouTuber. I don't have to worry about finding beats anymore. I don't have to worry about the copyright problem. He can also make exclusive beats for my videos. One of my favorite things that he's done so far, the last video that you guys saw yesterday, if you haven't checked that out, check out the card here. I'm trying to get better at pointing. It's gonna be here, the card right here. Check that video out. That's the first one that I used his beats in. He also made that beat exclusively for me, so that was a great ad for the YouTube video. I'll try to find this modded save that I have. By the way, before you guys say anything about a modded save, it's on my USB. You guys can look up how to do it if you want, and it's only story mode. I'm not gonna try hacking online or anything, that stuff is just stupid. I love the fact that Zay can make beats for me and I'm able to work with him. I kind of worked out a cross-platform promotion with him. He shares out my stuff, I use his beats, I don't have to run into a problem with copyright strike, and he gets free promotion. So I don't see any issue with that. If you guys would like to hire him, potentially, or just kind of make a deal with that, see if you can talk to him, like I said, down below in the description, his link's gonna be there. I also added a new thing to my description. I hope my mom's calling me. Uno momento. Hello? Hi. Okay. 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 I'm in the middle of recording, so that's why I was asking. I was- I, uh, put all my topics and stuff on a notepad, and then my phone started ringing. <laughs> yep. Yep. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you in a little bit. Alright, bye. I'm gonna fly one-handed while talking to my mom on the phone. Zay's also really good with ideas. He came up with this idea that I should put my stuff on a whiteboard back at home and kind of talk about the things I'm gonna do in a video, but I just put it down on a notepad next to my screen, so if I try to think of something to talk about, kind of spit out, hit the high points, holy crap. Oh my god. <laughs> I almost got taken out. My eyes are getting watery. Holy cow. <laughs> um, 
the middle of my sentence. That dude's going down. Oh. Yeah, I think I just destroyed him. Zay gave me the idea of... Whoa, there's water now. Can't even talk. Zay gave me the idea of writing stuff down so I can kind of hit the high points I want to talk about in a video and not really follow a script because I'm not going to be like that. Why would I play a video game and talk in a script? And all my stuff is basically fake at that point. But I got the high points here and uh, I put down... I'm going to read them off to you guys just to be, like I said, complete 100% clear. It says, trying to find free music for background. Copyright strikes are stupid. Copyright strikes later because of falling out. Shout out Zay. His link will be in the bottom of the videos. Hit him up if you want to talk business. I don't have to worry about finding beats. Exclusive beats and some beats from people that haven't even been heard by a majority are very good for originality in your videos. It just makes everything sound so much better. You sound more professional. It kind of just depends, of course, on the person making the beats. Luckily for me, Zay is a great guy. So like I said, be sure to go down, check out his stuff. I've been in a jet for the majority of this video. So I'm just going to hop out and end the video here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, go down, hit that subscribe button, as well as the little notification bell to stay up to date on all my videos. I'm going to get swarmed by cops. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please like, favorite, comment, subscribe. I'm going to take out these people. As always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.